This is Terry Newman. This is Spark for the Heart. I'm in a uh, cemetery here in Palarm. It's an old cemetery. You can tell everything's kind of grown up and everything. And I, sometimes I think we need to maybe visit a cemetery because there's some things that we can kind of learn, I think, from uh, cemeteries. I always like to visit where my grandma and grandpa are buried, my, bat, my dad, because it helps me kind of connect with them. But uh, these folks, I, I don't, I didn't know them, uh, didn't know anybody out here. But I think their lives speak to us because within each one of these graves, there are people who had potential. It may have been to write a song, to write a story, to uh, a teacher, uh, whatever the case might be, that they had some some potential that was really never actually tapped. And then they came to the end of life and they passed away and they never did that thing that really they were created to do. Uh, the flip side of that is this. There are a lot of people probably out here who made an impact in life in one way or another. In other words, the potential that God gave them, they were able to really fulfill. And they went to their burial site or left this life having really accomplished all that God would have them to do. I, I really believe that every one of us are created with God-given potential to do great things. Uh, and great is a relative term because it, it may be touching certain people. Uh, some people are great in that they touch masses of people, but not everybody is gonna be given that particular responsibility and availability. But whatever God has given you, don't let the day go by that you don't make the most of that day and Make sure that God uses you in a very, very special way, making yourself available. Um, I see these graves, and like I said, I don't know these people, but I do know this, that in each one of these graves, there are untapped potential that never uh, came into full fruition. And then on the other side, there are people that really did do some good things for the Lord and for life. So I want to challenge you today in your life on this day, do the most you can for the Lord Jesus Christ because today counts for eternity. God bless you.